Taking a look at your top stories, a Richmond County deputy jailer has been arrested after allegedly being involved in a domestic incident with her kid. Deputies say Diane Maltzby has been placed on administrative leave until the investigation is completed. Maltzby is facing a charge of reckless conduct and has been with the sheriff's office for nearly 22 years. In Barnwell County, a woman has been arrested in connection to a fentanyl-related death. Deputies say Rachel Roundtree is charged with voluntary manslaughter. Roundtree is on the Barnwell County Detention Center waiting for bond. Augusta commissioners are holding a special meeting this morning at 11 for a new ambulance service contract. Yesterday, commissioners voted 5-5 to five for the AmeriPro contract. Mayor Garnett Johnson then had to vote to break the tie, and he turned it down. Leaders will need to make a decision by 5 o'clock today. If not, then the state will make one. Parents in Aiken County are raising concerns about a new rezoning project that will help with the population growth. The school district is working on adding the Highland Springs Middle School. Leaders are providing four different options for students attending it. One of the top priorities for parents we spoke with is how close they are to the school. School leaders say they will use the community's feedback to help decide which option to go with. They plan to make the final decision at a board meeting next month. Augusta University is hosting a job fair today. There's going to be more than 80 employers, including the Augusta National Golf Club, SRNS, and Piedmont Augusta. This will be from 11 to 2 at the Kristenberry Fieldhouse on Wrightsboro Road.